Welcome to our channel, you should talk and today we will be talking about doppelgangers and do they share common DNA despite being unrelated to each other. If you have more details, please continue to watch this video. If you have ever thought you have an identical twin out there that you are unrelated to, guess what? You may be related to your doppelganger. People with very similar facial characters likely share genetic variants according to a paper published on August 23rd in the journal Cell Reports. Our study provides a rare insight into human likeness by showing that people with extreme lookalike faces share common genotypes whereas they are dis uh, discordant at the epigenome and microbiome levels, said senior author Mel Esteller, a researcher at the Joseph Carreras Leukemia Research Institute in Barcelona, Spain, in a press release. Estela and his team were inspired to look more into the phenomenon as more people post online of having a virtual twin without being genetically related to them. The researchers wanted to better understand if there is a genetic basis for random human beings sharing similar features. Uh, they recruited 32 pairs of lookalikes from Frank Weiss Brunel, a Canadian artist who was inspired to work on a photography project titled I'm Not a Lookalike after discovering his own lookalike. Rowan Atkinson was an English actor. The participants provided saliva for DNA tests as well as completed comprehensive questionnaire about their lifestyles. The researchers used three different facial recognition algorithms to objectively measure uh, the likeness of the pairs after obtaining their headshot pictures. The unique set of samples has allowed us to study how genomics, epigenomics, and microbiomes can contribute to human resemblance. 16 of the lookalike pair had similar scores to identical twins when analyzed by the same software. The study compared the DNA of the 16 pairs to discover if their DNA was similar, finding that 9 of these 16 pairs clustered together based on 19,277 common single nucleotide polymorphisms. The study also found other characteristics such as physical traits, for example, weight and height, as well as behavioral traits, such as smoking and education, also correlated in lookalike pairs. But experiences influence our DNA that and what genes are turned on and off, which is what scientists call epigenomes. And the environment influence our microbiome, the mix of bacteria, fungi, and viruses inside us. The study found that even though the participants had similar genomes, the epigenomes and microbiomes were different. That's all we have in today's video. Please continue to watch the space for more informative news. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.